His friend had to die because he thought they were people. A slow arrow breaks in the sad wolf's jaws. Scout plays hardy, swift and cunning. Her arrows cut you down to the sun. Canary first, mixed with elves, add dwarfs. Ugh, doesn't anyone drink their booze one at a time anymore? And the elves here are still squirrely. It's been a couple years. How's everything sitting with you? It's weird meeting back up and seeing everyone get their grey. First time I've been anywhere long enough to get fond of things. Leliana's friendly when she wants to be. My people sometimes do things for her, like I do for you. And all for Andraste, I suppose. It still rings right, but the way people used to go on about it, I thought there'd be more trumpets. When you start going on about elves, it's hard to tell if it's about them or you. Yes, yes, you're ever so clever, ass. Point is, the servants have no complaints, no asking for a Jenny. They serve this lot, but don't want them done for anything. So, the nobles are nice and the servants are happy? Two things that have never been true. Mark that I said it. We're fighting Canari, but something else is on the up. I suppose you've a lot to say about that elven ruin. About the creators. They're not even demons, just big magey knobs punching down. And yes, the shits who use them to make me feel broken can still eat it. But always waiting for that fight is way too much work. It's like doing half the hurt for them. Maybe we're old now, but I'm tired of it. We've new fights to look forward to. We always do, seems like. We'll talk later. Count on seeing you, yeah? I've sent word to the Bin Hasrath. We've got to stop this dragon's breath before it goes any further. It can't have been authorized. My people wouldn't do this. What can you tell me about the Canari we're dealing with? These aren't Bin Hasrath. They're specialists working for a Vidasala. Bin Hasrath handle normal security. The Vidasala's people focus entirely on magic. They find it, they study it, they neutralize it. And they must be desperate if they're using Alluvians. I'd expect them to shatter any mirror they find. If you've lost touch with the Ben Hasrath, what of our alliance? Well, the last time I heard from them, we were great. You killed Corypheus, sealed the breach, and closed a ton of rifts. They couldn't ask for more. This whole operation has to be a mistake. Bring me with you, and we'll figure it out. I promise. I'll talk to you later. Anytime, boss. You down to size, Scout lays harding, talked about taunting, laughs a light will be Everything going all right so far? So Bran used to be Viscount, and now he just follows you around? Provisional Viscount. Pretty much. With a permanent appointee, finally, in the Viscount's office, I am free to return to my post as Seneschal. He means my true calling is arrogantly telling people they can't talk to the Viscount. He's good at it, too. I'm surprised no one from the Council of Heralds wants your autograph. You just missed them. Duke Cyril keeps asking me for spoilers for my next book. I don't understand how you could just become a Viscount. When the ruler of a marcher state dies and there's no heir, the nobles of the city pick a new ruler. Only none of Kirkwall's nobles actually want the throne. Most of them think it's cursed, actually. They can't leave it empty, though, or some other state like Starkhaven or Ansberg will probably invade. I complained about the empty office when it interfered with my reconstruction efforts. They took that as volunteering. Any word from Hawk? I got a message from, well, best not to name an entire chain of smuggling syndicates in polite company. Anyway, 
Weishaupt is apparently the special kind of best that only appears when Hawk shows up. I'm not entirely sure how it'll all play out, but my money's on Hawk walking away from the Warden's Fortress as it explodes. We'll talk more another time. I'll be here if you need me. I do hope you recovered from your night at the opera. Any ear ringing should go away in a day or two. Need me for anything? You're more comfortable being called by your real name now. Comfortable? Not quite yet. I didn't want to be Rainier for such a long time. To be quite frank, he was an ass. But he's... I've changed. And reclaiming my name has allowed me to reconnect with people I haven't seen in years. Family. It wouldn't have happened without you. What do you think's going to happen at the Exalted Council? Maker, I have no idea. Politics always makes my head spin. The Inquisition shouldn't have to give in whenever some prissy noble gets their knickers wedged somewhere. It's nice to have everyone back in the same place again. <laughs> I have to admit, I missed it. What does it mean when we need a huge diplomatic talk or the world ending just to bring us together? I got the chance to have a few drinks with Sarah. Miss that girl. It's still a little awkward talking to Cassandra. But the commander appears to have forgiven me, finally. You don't seem to get flowers for Josephine anymore. You only just noticed. It's been years, and we both knew it was just a momentary infatuation. She still teases me about it. Every time I walk past, she sighs and says her desk lacks cheer. Until later. Take care. Something you needed? Have you had a chance to speak with Liliana? Away from work, I mean. Some, yes. Liliana has kept in contact, unofficially, of course, but it's good to see her again. Arguing with her in person is far more satisfying. Do you remember the first time we came to the Winter Palace? The end seemed far away then. <laughs> In some ways, the following year felt longer. The reason we're here is because we made a difference. That's worth enduring the political small talk. Is there any news from Ferelden? How's your family? My sister Mia keeps me informed. As I understand, she's training my nephew to best me at chess. Sometimes I miss the people I knew before Haven. We get so busy. It's easy for time to slip by. Perhaps. I'm not sure I regret that. I've still some time before these years balance those best forgotten. Is there anything I should know? We were permitted soldiers here, but our every move is watched. Some things never change. I should go. Inquisitor?
Darling, what can I do for you? I wanted your opinion of how Divine Victoria is working out. Leliana is managing to hold the Chantry together, just barely. Likely your influence. How are things for the Circle of Magi? If you call it the Circle while they're in earshot, you'll never hear the end of it, my dear. The College of Enchanters is a ridiculous mess, but it's still a useful institution for training mages. We'll talk another time. Quite the party, wasn't it? I hear it left the Orlesians and Ferelden's completely aghast. Andraste's Herald, the Inquisitor, toasting a Tabinta Magister. It's not a bad scandal to leave on. What is this ambassadorship about, exactly? I believe my father set it up, but... the Imperium certainly didn't object. They'd love for the Inquisition to fall apart. So they're happy if it seems they consider this council a waste of time. That makes no sense. No? If Dread to Vinter actually pushed for the Inquisition's end, everyone else would disagree on principle. So they send a nobody pariah and hope for the best. Makes perfect sense to me. Any thoughts about the Exalted Council? A few. Divine Victoria needs a new tailor for one. From the paintings of Liliana in that enormous robe, you'd think she was pregnant. Could cause a delicious scandal. As for this whole Exalted Council business, well... I warned you once that no one would thank you for saving the world. Sadly, I'm always right. So long as the Inquisition's around to remind them they're not really in charge, they'll never sleep comfortably. Whether they have the guts to take action, I suppose we'll see. What did you do in Tevinter while you were away? I went home. Twice. The father was only there once. Mother was drunk both times. I also went to Carinus to see my good friend Mayveris. Then I settled some of Alexis's affairs. That wasn't fun. Another time. I look forward to it. did Varric, of all people, become the Viscount of Kirkwall? Oh, a mystery for the ages. I hear you've been rebuilding the Seekers. Slowly, but yes. I managed to find a few of my former comrades who'd scattered to the winds. Some of them were unsuitable, and I did not ask them to return. Others felt as I did once they read the Lord Seeker's tome. We've since recruited a few candidates who are going through training now, with full disclosure. What comes after this, I cannot be certain. I'm making it up as I go along. I'm sure you'll be fine, Cassandra. I need to be better than fine. I want to build something that is worthy of lasting. <laughs> 